The label page lets you customize the design of everything on the information panel. This includes the nutrition fact panel, the ingredient list, the allergens, and your business name and address. To get started, choose the label type that you want to use. From there, you can decide what sections you want to include. Keep in mind that everything you include will be part of your export, so if you wanted to hide the recipe title, you could hide it, or you could show everything. If you need to edit the actual content of the nutrition fact panel or ingredient statement, just go to the ingredient statement tab or the recipe tab, and you can change those things there. Within the label style section, you can adjust the display of the servings, the justification and casing of the text, the width of the label, and the color of the text and the background. From this page, you have the ability to check off any allergens in your product, set the business name and address, which you can also make a default across all recipes, and include the facility allergens, which is optional but recommended. You'll also see any potential nutritional claims you can make on your recipe, in this case, sodium-free. You also have optional nutrients you could decide to show, such as unsaturated fats, sugar alcohols, or protein percentage, and there's a lot of optional vitamins that you can choose to include if you want or if you make a claim about them. If these are settings you're going to be using across recipes, you can make them your default so you don't have to set them up each time. And finally, you can choose to export your label as a PDF, PNG, or get the code to embed it. And we have a great deal with Avery when you're ready to print those labels. And if you need to download more than one label at a time, we have a bulk export feature that lets you select all the labels you want at once. If you have questions about the label page or anything else in Recipal, just let us know how we can help.